Taylor and we are live in London. Today I have two very exciting guests. I have the all-round Ginger Ninja and comedian Keith Lemon. Ninja. I didn't know I were a ninja. Yeah, you are, officially. <laughs> and the most amazing, gorgeous actress, singer and presenter, Ashley Roberts. <laughs> They're here to talk about Keith Lemon coming in America, which starts tomorrow night, ITV2, 10 o'clock. Don't miss it. Now, if you want to get in touch at home, please do send us a tweet at Build Series LDN. And if you're watching on Facebook, then just pop a little question in the comments section below, and we'll do our very best to get to you in the next 20 minutes. Now, guys, coming in America. Yeah, yeah. We went to America. Well, you, you lived in America. You are American, I, aren't you? I am American most of the time. Yeah, yeah. Most, yeah. Just most of the time. Most of the time. I do half and half. <laughs> Um, why America and why now? Because we were going to do a coming in Japan. <laughs> and, uh, we just... Is that maybe next? Is that maybe but next? I, I didn't know any Japanese people that we could get on the show. Mm. Do you know any Jap <laughs> famous Japanese uh, people? No. No. That little kid from Indiana Jones. <laughs> Uh, but I don't think you recognise him because he's a man now he with is. with all the faculties of a man. He's got all the hairs and everything, and um, so you wouldn't recognise him. But we've got a really ec eclectic mix of people in the show, and we've got Ashley, who's a very good actress, as you mentioned. I didn't know you came under that heading now of actress. Is that how you're selling yourself? I guess it's on the uh, well, resume I get, now. I, I, yeah, yeah. yeah, I, I, did, I decided to give it to you today. So <laughs> thank you. I was just early in talking you about are. you before you came here, and, and I said how good actress you are. You were not. I was. He actually did. I was, For real, I was. and I said you've got well, to I tell just, her. I didn't say I didn't say it like that. You're a bit spicier, what I said. It was. It's Ooh. not suitable for. Yeah. I'm a little telly. feisty up Very good. Up very good. <laughs> and, and yeah, and she put up with a lot of my silliness. Yeah. Well, it sounds like you had a lot of fun. We've actually got a trailer, so let's show that, and then we can talk about everything we see in it. It's exciting. I mean, it looks hilarious. It, well, it was a lot of fun. It, it was looks a lot like of fun. you had a lot of fun. What was it like being unknown in America? I liked it because I didn't have to go to like really poncy um, bars like like in London and and wherever else in the UK. I have to go to posh places. Because obviously you're very well known in America. Oh, I would yeah, say I can't, yeah. I can't walk around anywhere. <laughs> on can the you can you walk when you walk around in America? Does everyone recognise you? No, no, not really. But you really, were, I would have thought. I mean, yeah, she's from did. the pussy not, cat easy. dolls. Easy, <laughs> easy killer. <laughs> I do have a friend that, that knows you, an American friend, though, so that's exciting. Is that after the I'm show? Excited. Or? She loves Celeb Juice. Right. I told oh. you about her. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Well, so you're not that unknown. So, oh, yeah, what, I'm what a bit was unknown. Like, though? Well, you're mostly unknown there. Most. Yes. What was it like just be filming there and being there? How long were you there it for? It was hot <laughs> and full of Americans. Hey, no. <laughs> How did they? How did they receive you? How did you go down? Well, well most people in America. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> I didn't mean it like that. Awesome. <laughs> most people in America can't understand what I'm saying, but the crew that we use, I've used them for a good few years, and they can understand me. I like watching their faces as I talk to Americans because they can understand me. That they know that that American can't understand me. Can you understand me? Do you, you don't bit. always understand me. Not always. Yeah, yeah. I mean, most of the time, but not all the time. <laughs> the you don't understand when I say butter, because... B butter. Butter, Butter, yeah. butter. 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 And the, I want a Peanut glass, butter. glass of water. 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 Okay, yeah. So, I, I mean, water so they butter. didn't always <laughs> get what, what you... It's always a nice <laughs> meal. Watery butter. I love watery butter. <laughs> <laughs> Talking about watery butter, let's talk Sounds about... <laughs> let's Just talk imagine about it going the... down the crack, right? <laughs> Oh, oh, sorry. <laughs> okay, let's talk about the process of the show. Um, how did it work when you were filming over there? Did you sort of plan what guests and characters you were going to have? Or? Oh, so the, the sketches in it. It's yeah. a little bit like a show I did called Lemon La Vida Loca. Yeah. Because um, it's like spoof reality, although some of it is real. Um, but we spice up a little with sketches, and they were written. But all the spoof reality, or reality... Um, it, is not written, so you didn't have a script. It was kind of basically... It's like points. Yeah, yeah, I'm going <laughs> to come gonna in come here. They're going to come in here and do I'm, this. I'm going to be sick. And then you say what you're doing, and then I'll say I'm being sick. So it, was, yeah. it was pretty yeah. well, Action. well thought yeah. through like that. <laughs> a little, the, the just scenes were sort of what happens here. Yeah. And then we just do it, I guess. Yeah. And Twice, what, really, and then it's done. It? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Quite quick, wasn't it? It was quick. What were the criteria of the guests to kind of feature on the show, or did you just as, literally as call everyone As long as it's a, an odd mix, really. It was, <laughs> it's a really odd mix. You've got Gene Simmons with his hair that's made out of burnt grass. <laughs> and you, you um, went bowling. 
cuddling with him and ended yeah. up naked. I ended up naked, yeah. I, I, I actually love Gene Simmons, but he does try and belittle you with his macho bravado. Mm. Oh. Uh, and then you, you show him us boss and get naked. <laughs> And, um, and that clearly worked, did that? And there was, there was um, Billy from the film Gremlins, Zach Galligan, he's in it, because we did a sketch about That's Elliot awesome. from E.T. Yeah. Um, where's Elliot from E.T. now? And E.T. has come back, but he's not as nice, and his finger lights up, yes, but it also does other things. It's a naughty <laughs> finger. <Ooh. laughs> So Elliot's uh, not in a happy place at the moment. Is and he goes to therapy, and that's where he meets Billy from Gremlins and Sloth from Goonies. And do they all get on yes. all right? Or? Well, they talk about their problems, like um, Chunk from the film Love Goonies. Chunk. He's talking about it, saying, yeah, um, Sloth really keeps, keeps hugging me too much. <laughs> and, and, and he keeps pulling his pants down and stuff, oh. which eventually so, you see, obviously. Because it's it pure Sounds like out. someone else it's you know, quite well who does yeah, that. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I like to pull my pants down. <laughs> This, uh, the bear, the, you know, the bear from Boss Selector, he's in it. He's hanging out with um, the Urban Fox. Yeah. The... Not loads, but he's in it a bit. I keep forgetting Kelly Brooks in it as well. Kelly Brooks in She's it. In it. She's Brooks. in it. I know Kelly Brooks. So she She's do in Matalan it. with her. We did do a lot of Matalan. <laughs> Matalan. <laughs> Matalan. Because <laughs> obviously, Matalan. Ashley, you're you yes. know, over in America and you were. Uh, you were very, there were lots of like guests who were very warm and welcoming to, to Keith, and you were actually one of them. We're going to see a clip mm. of when he arrives and you guys first see each other. So let's go to that. <laughs> That's the first Excellent. time I saw that. Yeah. yeah. Um, so he obviously stayed with you. What's it like having Keith as a house guest? Is he well behaved? Oh, totally well behaved. Yeah, he's not waking off with the door open or anything, is he? <laughs> <laughs> Never. Shh. <laughs> totally, G. And, and has he got any any particular house and habits? Yes, she just told you. Yeah, I did. <laughs> that was a habit, a house habit. You've got to love yourself before you can love other people. <laughs> that was deep. That's pretty yeah, deep, yeah. actually. Was, yeah. I did propose to you. Well, I was yeah, going to come yeah. on to this. Yeah. But let's do it now. Yeah. Can you t tell me a little bit about that scene because it is in the trailer when you get down on one knee. It was in order to get a green card so I could stay in America. <laughs> Yeah. It's not because I fancy her, because she's rough as hell. <laughs> and, um, but I asked to... I remember doing that scene? I remember doing that scene. Well, that woman. So what yeah. was... The horse lady. Oh, my God, the horse lady. Yeah. She was my favourite. Tell about Who's the, horse, the horse, lady? horse lady? The horse lady would not claim an age. She doesn't know her age. Um, That's handy. And she had to call her parents, right, to figure out her yeah. age. She was wow. just free, she was, flowing in life. She was in her 20s, life. wasn't she? So I how was she involved she was in, in the 20s. engagement? Well, Slash she, we, we went, we she went on a horse... Ride. ride. And ride. she was our leader. Yeah, she was telling us how to roast, ride horses. <laughs> <laughs> and then she was talking about her back, doing oh, her, yeah. the back in. And then you said you did your back in once. I and then you asked her how old ground. she was. And then she went, actually, I don't, I don't know. I don't know how and she old didn't I am. Know, she, last time she knew she was 19 when she celebrated her birthday. Yeah. And then you were like, Many moons you're trying to quiz her, quiz her a little bit. And then I just went, I think it's so cool that you don't know how old you are. Because <laughs> the age ain't not but a number, innit? It's just so cool. And then looking at Ashley going, What the? <laughs> of course, in LA. But I don't well, know. How I was old like, I am. so cool. Yeah. <laughs> She was a trip. She was lying. She was a trip. She was so probably lying. Lying. You know she was probably you are, lying. You know how you are, don't you? You have to write it down. Just avoid it. Just yeah. avoid the question. So she was... Those horses were feisty, remember? They were feisty little fellas. Oh, I had a little brown onion riding? in my pants. I did. Yeah. I, didn't like, I, didn't like, I don't like horses. He doesn't the like mouths horses. are too big. Or stingrays. No, I don't like no. stingrays. So this is another th little task that you guys did, slash something that you filmed. You went paddle boarding. Aqua yoga. Aqua yoga. Aqua, Aqua yoga. Yes, namaste. Which is actually namaste. pretty hard. Namaste. It's pretty hard. It is it? hard. It's, it's a lot of core work. <laughs> it was easy. You have an issue. But hang on a minute. There were stingrays there as well. Yeah, yeah but they wanted me to fall in and go, oh, I'm rubbish at it, but all right, good at it. And um, I wasn't falling in because it's full of stingrays and Steve Irwin died with one. So what's going to happen when there's thousands of them die and die and die and die again? <laughs> no, I'm not doing it. Fair enough. I, I was like, it's, it's Keith Lemon coming to America. If I die now, <laughs> it's just going to be called coming in America and you're just going to film shots of America. Did you, did you throw any other strops throughout <laughs> filming? or just that one? Well, it's weird because the interior... Because it's not real. You know, like Coronation Street, it's not real. What? So, most, I thought it was real. No, 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 no. A lot of it's real and a lot of it's not real. Right. But mm. the interiors of the house in this show were filmed here in yeah. winter. Yeah. So we were, like, in the pool... 
acting like freezing. it's summertime. <laughs> yeah. That, so, that exterior you just saw, saw that, that was in America. Yeah. That, that your, so your house, that your house sitting for, that's in America. Yeah, that was in LA. The exterior? That, the exterior was in LA. The, the interior, interior was in London. Yeah. Well, really? no but you can't way. tell. You can't tell. You can't tell. No, you really can't. I would never have known. No? I know, and also, so obviously you get your new agent over there and she decides it's a really good idea for you to throw a house party. Yeah, mm. and it's rubbish. Oh, really? The only part was rubbish because I didn't know any American, famous American people apart from you. Yeah, and, and I didn't have friends. And you didn't have any friends. Well, no. you did, but not introducing me to yeah. one. Yeah, yeah. Did, I mean, did you did you help him settle in? Did you introduce him to anyone? I took you out one night with, yeah, with the girls. Yeah, yeah, with the girls. Yeah. Oh, that's when I was sick. Yeah, well, you got a little yeah, tipsy, yeah. didn't you? Yeah, I don't do shots. No? I just drink beer. So I, can't, I don't know what happens. I can't control shots. No, you can't. Uh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so you had your house party, and one of the big names there was Stevie Ritchie from the X Factor. Stevie Ritchie, he's the most famous person I know. <laughs> yeah. Well, I was I was surprised when I saw him. He's a lovely like, fellow. He is. He's he like, is. But his cuffs on his jackets are always too long, <laughs> and I always tell him your jacket's too big for you. <laughs> and ha- what does he say? He's always oh, is it is it is it? Yeah, yeah. Because I can't even see knuckles. Just sees these little tips. <laughs> it looks like loads of willies just hanging out of bottom of your arm. <laughs> On style, obviously there was a there was a focus group, and one of the one of the comments from the focus group was saying that you'd look like you were wearing your pajamas. Oh, this focus group, that bit is real, and we had a, a group of punters watching the worst of celebrity juice, the, the rudest stuff, the rudest bit, featuring the bum sandwich, <laughs> in which um, Gino bits. lost the end of his finger, and um, in a bum, uh, in a bum, yeah. Oh no. And, and I thought, well, you know what? It, look, you don't need a point that much, man. It's just a bit of fun on a Thursday night. Don't <laughs> stick your finger in. Oh, my and, God. Um, but one of the ladies, she said, <laughs> What's this? Another guy from the UK thinking that he's all funny and all that. Ain't gonna work. He got ginger hair. Is he wearing pajamas? <laughs> so she said that. I don't like him. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I don't and, like him. And my soul just, it was like a balloon that just went. <laughs> Oh. And I thought, oh, this isn't going to go well. And I thought I'd be able to take it. Yeah. But, you know, them slagging me off. But, oh, horrible. I went, I feel a bit down. Oh. Feel, can we go get, like, a, a burger or something? Oh, six just, yeah, get, get a milkshake or something. Mom, milkshake what, how, did, how did you deal with those negative comments then? You went for a milkshake. Ashley, did you kind of help coach him through his hard, tough times over there? Yeah, oh. I tried to. Yes, I tried to lift your spirits. Did you? Yeah. When, what, what? I told you you're fabulous. Yeah, she does. Inside She's fabulous. Just a little bit of you know what I mean? fabulousness. She's very the good. natural As you just saw, good. very good. Very mm. good. <laughs> well done. Gracias. Thanks for being part of my ridiculous world. Thanks for bringing look, me look, in. Look what I'm doing. I know, because <laughs> this is a new technique that we haven't <laughs> seen before, and I quite like it. <laughs> you get nervous. Sweaty pits on me. <laughs> Will that piss on you? Sweaty pits. Oh. <laughs> Well, no, never. Sometimes you just don't really know what's going to happen. You don't, do you? <laughs> a bit like in your documentary when you, you were saying earlier that actually sometimes you don't really know what you're going to be filming and you just leave the house and you're like, right, let's see what we come yeah. across. Tell us kind of about some of the things that you came well, across that were particularly random. Sometimes um, they'll set some up and I'll be in on it and sometimes I'm not in on it and I don't know if it's real. And um, we did a thing where I pre- presented a car programme, and I don't know anything about cars, but I said that I did. And the producers were like, looking at it like I was Ronald McDonald, like I was a lunatic. And first of all, because of what I was wearing, maybe, I don't know. <laughs> but um, I didn't know anything about cars, and then I was interviewing punters and just go, so your car, um, <laughs> tell us about how many wheels has it got? <laughs> And uh, that was just rubbish. <laughs> but that was that's part of the show, I guess, me failing. Yeah. Me failing in America. It's not, I, I don't want anyone to watch it and think, ha, ha, he failed. Yeah, on purpose. <laughs> so, so hopefully it's humorous. I, well, I, I, it but, looks like it is very But again, humorous. yeah, I, I, afterwards I'd be like, are they actors? Oh, is this one real? Oh, this one's <laughs> real. You should have told me because I'd actually like a job of you. <laughs> I went on Price is Right. I know, I was about to say, you, you did have Price a major right. success, which was Price is Right. It's big in America, Price yeah, is Right, isn't it? Tell Tell it how did yeah. that come about? Was that your agent or was that your own the, doing? I, I, that's my agent, and I went there and I said, um, hello, I went up to the office and said, hello, my name's Keith Lemon, I think I'm filling in for Drew Carey today. And they, were, and they didn't believe me, and I said, you, someone must have emailed you, I'm, I'm sure he's ill and I'm filling in today. And then they said, oh, no, you, you're just a guest. That's all right. And so what do I do? We get in the line, not the queue. You don't have queues in America. No, we don't do queues. Line. Lines. Lines. Get in the line. And um, I said, don't know. They went, you're in the audience. Oh. So I'm just sat in the audience, and that camera crew were just filming me looking like this. <laughs> 
And then they went, Keith Lemon, come on down! And then I played Price is Right, for real. So cool. And what's funny is, because I I don't know how rude you can be on American TV. Not rude So they got me up and they asked me a little bit about myself. I said, my name's Keith Lemon, Um, I'm I'm from England. And he says, are you having a good time? I said, yeah, yesterday I went shopping. Um, I had some new underpants on. I didn't realise they were new ones. You know when sometimes you get a little sticker on your clothes? Like, it's been tested, hasn't it? Yeah. Uh, I went to the toilet and I had number 29 on me, Willie. (laughs) And I thought that's that's, really that's been on that had been on my willy all day, and I had stopped to go to the toilet. In the bed. I just must not have looked down. Just have a wee. Maybe it's good luck. Yeah. I took number twenty nine on your willy. Yeah. Is your lucky number? Don't know. Maybe. But I've just recently been to America again because this was all filmed last year. We can't remember anything. Yeah. And um, <laughs> but I've just been doing fruit key all there. And um, it happened again, this sticker on Willy thing. But, no. not, on me, not, but not on me Willy, just it's on like me a bum. like magnet for stickers. Just on me bum. Just on that bum. Yeah, yeah, well, just getting into bed. Went, What's that? Ooh. Oh, it's one of them. I like you. Uh, yeah. I took a picture. I'll send you it. Thank you. I appreciate that, Please that. do feel free to share that picture with all of us. Uh, now, as you say, we have lots of characters in, who are cameoing in uh, Coming in America. Jack and Sharon Os- Osborne. Jack and Sharon Osborne. I'm supposed to go, I think, is it called base jumping? Yeah. Is it base jumping? Base jumping, we jump off the... Yeah, yeah. The that. bridge? Yeah, well, we didn't. We just went and bought some clothes for a dog for his mum instead. <laughs> oh, okay, that's probably but safer. The, she, she's a bit like um, Louis Walsh is Sharon. I know they're very close, but she's a good gossiper. Oh, well, yeah, she loves a good gossip. <laughs> yeah, I said, uh, um, I said, who's the... Who, what, can, what word can I replace it with? Um, who's the biggest carpet you've met? Carpet? <laughs> And then she, she said, Ash, Ashton Kutcher is a right carpet. No. Did she say that? Yeah, yeah. Her and that was like, exclusive. And she said, you wanted me to say it, didn't you? <laughs> <laughs> I, yeah, you lovely. I, I love the Osbournes. Yeah, well, I know you also you've got Taylor Swift and Katy Perry. They're both in it. Yeah, because we know they get on well. Yeah. And it's just about them getting on so well. Yeah. And trying not... It's a bit like Tom and Jerry, if I was honest. And, <laughs> and it's, it's quite violent, there's blood. I think she stabs her. Uh, it few... It's not that actually them, that's me and my no, friend Mad really? Paul. Yeah. I thought it was a real no, deal. No, no, it's, it's me. It's good makeup though. <laughs> really good makeup. It looks slightly Uncanny, like her. Actually. It, could, it does look a little Uncanny. bit like her. You look good as a girl though. It's scary. Actually. Do, can we actually just touch upon this? Why do you make such a good girl? I think it's I've got eyes. nice eyes. <laughs> <laughs> Facial hair really adds as well. Yeah, that throws it a little <laughs> bit, doesn't it? But I, 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 can't, I can't shave it off. I need it because it's, it's my thing, isn't it? It's your it thing. Is. It's, it's your thing, thing and yeah. it's a good thing. Now, actually, did Keith get swept up at all in the LA lifestyle, in the Hollywood lifestyle? Oh, yeah, he was getting all involved in all kinds of different things, weren't you? I mean, pretty much... You, you've, you've had a PR training, haven't you? Excuse me? You've had PR training. Baking powder? <laughs> <laughs> Like, like when you're in pussycat dolls, you no, we actually like, never had training. Oh, did they just no. kick you out? Just and shoved go, us right in. Go on. Plug the, <laughs> plug the songs. <laughs> Hello, we were little robot dolls. I'm you know just, what I mean? I'm just surprised how, how many answers you know to these questions. Cause I'm like, did I? I mean, yeah. Well, yeah. I mean, you went out. We went he, out one night, which is an LA thing. You yeah. Go out, have you also to went to LA, see. You, you had a, a, a you had a chemical peel. Yeah. Oh yeah. Which is an LA thing. I went to a plastic surgeon. And you went to a plastic surgeon. I know. A program box yeah. where you people come in guy. with like bat wings hanging off of them. Yeah. So get rid of those bat wings. And he was so trying to get tell you... me tell me about when you went to see the surgeon in box. It just demoralized me and made oh. me feel that poo. They just says, yeah, yeah. I said I was um, 34, of yeah. course. I'm not though, I'm 35. Mm. And um, <laughs> and um, he, but he said for a 34 year old man, you, you don't look bad, but this thing we can make you better. And I just said, will I be faster? And he was confused yeah. by that. Yeah. Like, what it's do you confusing. mean? I went, because, well, I'd be just, you know, do things quicker. Aerodynamically. And you were like, if I move my nipple, will it still work? Well, I was talking, because he was talking about moving my nipples up. He says, I can... I can <laughs> what have you been using them, them for? Up. You need higher Sometimes. nipples? Yeah. Put them on my shoulder as shoulder pads. I don't, I, I don't know why Again, I wanted to move my nipples. Again, style first. Style first. But so, people yeah. do that in LA, don't they? Get them all, get all done. They get all kinds of things done. He can get you downstairs all tidied you up can as well, can't you? that up, yeah, you, you can. can. You can get whatever you want. And who, who was the most sort of interesting character that you met over there? Well, Gene Simmons is interesting. He is, isn't he? Yeah, have I, met him, Gene yeah I have. He's giving me the it's the tall, isn't he? a little bit. His, his hair's like the shape helmet. of his Darth Vader's helmet. Yeah. And, it, yeah, it's odd texture. And it gives off an interesting vibe. Yeah, but I, I, I said vi- to... What's the, what kind of vibe does he give off? Uh, it, it, it just makes me itch a smidge. You know what I mean? An itchy vibe? Yeah, it gives me... I just itch a little bit. Yeah. In weird <laughs> places. I know what you mean. I, I, it, it tries to belittle you, doesn't it? A little bit. 
Yeah, you, you, being you, a said, female. you said that. But well, I, I just grabbed all of him. I said, Gene, I think you're nice, and I'm nice. Will you just be nice to me? And, and he was just smiling. Did it work? And he did. He dropped it he a little nice. bit. And he's like, kind of like, look, this is what I've got to do. This is what I sell. I'm, this is my brand. Like, yeah. I'm scary. His kids. persona. Uh, yeah. 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 Like yeah. But I like him. And you had, yeah. you had a few meetings about your brand over there, didn't you? Yeah. What What did they, from the outside looking in, what did they see? Well, everyone just in America I think that I met thinks I'm alone. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah. But that's my job. <laughs> and, you're, and you're really you good at it. <laughs> 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 I think that's my job to be. It's like it's weird on like Twitter and stuff when someone calls me a carpet. I go, yeah, it's my job to be a carpet. What's your excuse? <laughs> <laughs> I get paid for being a carpet. Uh, we're going to go to our audience. Uh, we've got a question from Mark. Oh, Mark, where are it's you? Not carpet. Oh, what is your uh, what's your question carpet. for the guys? Mm. Uh, Keith, uh, what parts of the East America oh, do you like and? Uh, what did you enjoy doing out there? I, I don't know many parts of America. I've only been to Florida. I like Florida. That's all. I've been to um, San oh. Diego yeah. for the Comic Con. I've been there for Comic Con. Apparently, it's very quiet when the Comic Con's not on, but whilst it's on, it's really good. And they have lots of themed bars. Like, if you like Ghostbusters, the Ghostbusters bar. And I'm, I'm a massive, you know, a massive geek. And um, yeah. I like all that stuff. Um, LA, what, what can I say about LA? It's... I think it's like a big telly studio, mm. and behind the TV studio, it's always a bit rubbish, isn't it? It's not as good as when you're on stage. Yeah. Behind's a bit rubbish. That, that's Did a you feel like that's you were behind? LA, yeah, that's it? a good description. It's a studio. Yeah. It's, it's not a real place, is it? No, uh, not really. Do you know what I mean? I, I know what you mean. But you know it, Mark. You probably know it, like you know people live there. And stuff. I only There's know it like filming there. there. Yeah. People do live there. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, I do have a house there still. Deal. You can come stay there sometime if you want. And then you oh, can right. live in there and see what it's like. Oh, we'll stop paying for hotels then. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Coming in America uh, Series uh, 2, yeah, maybe? Yeah. I don't know. C c can I come in America again? Maybe. Can, can, can you come, if they can liked you, it. Can you come in something twice? You, yeah. <laughs> you can. You tell can me, you? Keith. Yeah. You tell I me. I, I, well, we'll see. Well, if people watch it, it's in a lovely slot. It's on at 10 o'clock on Thursday, straight after the Island of Love. Oh, yeah. you've been watching that. I'm not, I'm not a massive... Love Island watcher, but uh, you know, everyone's attractive. I don't see what the jeopardy is. You're not gonna, you know, <laughs> she's dumped me that fit girl. Never mind, there's six more fit birds. <laughs> <laughs> it's true, actually. I mean, no it's and, and, same way, and same with the girls, the guys are all good yeah. looking, so it's, I, I don't understand the jeopardy. I'd like to see a normal looking person go in there and become a hero, though, and, and get could, the fittest one, girl or guy. Could you see Keith Lemon doing Love Island? I, I'd like to go in there and just go, don't like any of you. <laughs> <laughs> you, you're too shallow for me. Ashley, what about you? I have been tuning in. Yeah, it is a guilty pleasure. I had been in LA when all this was going on and seeing all my British friends tweeting like, Love Island, what's happening? I'm like, what is this show? Yeah. So this year I've tuned in a bit. There's a lot going on. I know this, I mean, it's hard to keep track of it, but it is yeah. brilliant. Right, we're going to go... Savage stuff. Yeah, we're not plugging <laughs> Love Island, we're coming in America. Right. We've, got, we've, got another, we've got another social question. Happy 4th of July. Obviously, as you can see, our studio here is 4th of July themed. Um, what is the worst thing that you ate in the USA? Oh. Ooh, I don't know. Well, I, I think, no offence, all the food tastes like cake. Meat tastes cakey. You think so? Really? And it's it yeah, it's all meeting? sweet. It's all sweet. It's so sweet. And um, I came back from America. My trousers didn't fit me. And all I had were Cobb salads. No, you didn't. Oh, you did. You did. Oh, yes, I did. <laughs> and, um, Cobb but salads are, are fatty, though, honey. Are they? Yeah. That's... I, I, don't, I say don't put the dressing on. I'll do that myself. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Don't put the dressing on. Don't put the dressing on. You so I didn't eat bread for two weeks, and so then my trousers fit again. Bread is dead. Bread is, oh. is the devil. Well, bread is the devil. I like it? the bread. Do you eat bread? I do eat bread. How do you keep so fit? I work out. I don't. Do you not work out? <laughs> no. It's boring. You know it's boring. I love it. Do you? I do. Do you work out? I do, yeah. It's boring, Not though. all the time, but... It's boring, yeah. isn't it? Working out. <laughs> I, find, I think Fun. it's weird sweating in front of people. Go, oh, 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 in front of people. I want to do that workout. What's well, that? Yeah. I mean, what, workout, you... are you... <laughs> <laughs> what workout are you doing? No. <laughs> well, pu pushing mm. weights and stuff. Yeah, pushing those things. Yeah, yeah. Um, now... <laughs> oh. <laughs> you don't go like that, do you? <laughs> mm -hmm. 
<laughs> no? Oh, look, you don't... Ah, I thought you... It's the sound effects <laughs> that I'm really enjoying. <laughs> You know, you know oh you, you ever go up really quickly, like really quickly, and go, oh, excuse me. Because <laughs> you've made a fast move. When I was a kid, I used to break dance. I used to be the best break dancer in Leeds. So I was in a club. Can you still do it? I'm not doing it. Oh, go and, uh, on. But if, Come on. Proper on, break dancing? On, honestly, if you turned the music off, all you would hear whilst I was break dancing would be. <laughs> Uh, like, okay, I think one, one, one of those is... ones. One of those. Like, Stop. Like, yeah! Oh, look at that! You want me to fall off? I know you did it though. Yeah, I can do some of that. Oh, oh, oh but, it's uh, a bonkers uh, bit. Hang on a minute. Yeah. This, does this featuring coming in America? I've done break dancing on telly loads of times, I think. I know, but specifically coming in America. Me, me, me break dancing's been out as much as me Willie has. I'm sure it has. That's and a me, lot. And me Willie's getting it's on lot. sitcom. I mean, how many times is it out this series? Only once, I think, because my mum's in it. My mum's not in I me just, willy, my mum's in the show. <laughs> I didn't realise she's... A, because I have actually read that you're trying to be a bit cleaner for this series coming in America. But I'm always trying to be clean. I, I never want to offend anyone, but I'm really childish. And, then, <laughs> and fart noises and stuff make me laugh. But, um, yeah, my mum's in this show. You know my mum. I know your mum. Uh, what, what, how, what, how does she feature? She plays my mum. <laughs> no. And, um, and she also plays um, Chris Jenner in The Kardashians. Yeah. And um, that's it. She's got two roles. Excellent. And um, you used to play Caitlyn Jenner, didn't I you? I did play Caitlyn. Yeah, I actually really enjoyed some of yeah. those scenes, by the way. <laughs> but, but she's not in the Kardashians anymore, she's is she? Not. They disowned they her. Kicked her out. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Sorry, you're out. <laughs> It can be a brutal <laughs> world, LA. Yeah. It can be a brutal yeah. world. Yeah. Uh, now, we do have a quick, quick fire question. So, obviously, some of the advice that was given to you over in America was say yes more. Yes. So, I want to know. <laughs> The, the pair of you, if you would say yes to the following. Yes. Okay. Keith, would you say yes to forming a pop band with Ashley and becoming a singer? Yes. Ashley, would you say yes to this? Yes. Ashley, would you take a bath in horse manure so that Keith could be invited to James Corden's next party? No. <laughs> Sorry, mate. <laughs> horse manure? Uh, yeah. No Keith, way. would you say yes to going on tour with Kanye, but the role is to babysit North? No. Oof, OK. Uh, Keith, would you swap your British passport to become a fully-fledged American, even if it meant you couldn't come back to the UK? No, I'd miss Holly and Fern and Gino and Paddy McGuinness. Sweet. Um, Ashley, would you say yes to coming in America too? Yes. Would you say yes to marrying Keith Levin? She said no. No. <laughs> I just, Not I, even to get a green card. Yeah, I, know, I, I, thought, I thought I'd just try it one more time for you. Thanks. <laughs> Guys, um, thank you so much for coming in today. A big thank you to our audience. A big thank you to you guys at home for watching. Do not forget that tomorrow night, ITV2, coming in America with the amazing Keith Lemon and Ashley Roberts. And that's mom. it. And, and, your mom. Mom. and your mum. And your mum. <laughs> and your mum. Thanks so much for watching. Have Cheers. a great time. We'll see you next time. Cheers. <laughs>